Hi everybody, this is Mewkin for Let's Play Pokemon Leaf Green. I'm back. Now that actually did take forever in a day as you probably would have expected. However, uh, it didn't take as long as I thought it would. We did a lot of attack grinding. Uh, and I mean a lot of it. Uh, there are only two, uh, two Pokemon that didn't do a ton of attack grinding. Esphere was not one of them. Now, Esphere was actually... Um, a little easier uh, to grind up because traded Pokemon, I didn't cover this before, but traded Pokemon have an experience bonus. Uh, every time they gain experience, they gain it at a rate of one and a half times greater than anybody else. So that made a sphere a little easier to train. And I know it doesn't look like, uh, look like it by a stat, but I did very little special attack training. The reason I did so much uh, attack training, and I know I lied, I said I'd keep Sonic Boom, replaced it with Rollout once we got that. Good attack, by the way. Rock type, so it's a little more versatile than Electric type. And it, uh, it keeps getting stronger. But the reason we did so much attack grinding is to alleviate the weakness of, well, his attack. I mean, Shockwave and Spark. Spark, by the way, being a really good attack, uh, relatively powerful. It said it's supposed to paralyze your opponent. I've never seen that. And I used the hell out of it. So, you decide how much stock to put in that. But Shockwave and Spark are going to do a good amount of damage. Rollout and Tackle, we needed to do some attack, uh, attack grinding for that. Um, Freya was one of the two Pokemon which I didn't go out of my way for, for attack power. The reason being, her special attack was lagging badly. And her primary attacks... Water Pulse and Surf are water-based, so we needed to do some special attack training to uh, to alleviate that weakness. Uh, with Hatsune, we did a ton of attack power grinding, simply because Hatsune, though not hasn't been useful since we got her, she's actually going to be relatively useful coming up really soon. Uh, Sukasa, we did a ton of special attack training. She's a psychic Pokemon. Why not? And Ragnarok, we did a ton of attack power grinding. However, we also did one level of special attack grinding. So, really, the reason we did that one is because we're eventually going to teach Ragnarok a special based attack. Go figure. Now, remember those gold teeth that we got uh, back in the Safari Zone? No, neither do I. But hey, if you give them to the Warden... We can actually understand them! No one can understand a word I, that I said, not a one. <laughs> okay. HM4. Now, HM4 is one of those HMs that's required to beat the game. It is strength. Let's go ahead and teach it to a Pokemon. We're going to be teaching it to Ragnarok. Yeah, I know it probably would be a good idea to teach it to Freya, considering Freya has an attack power that's a lot higher. Uh, plus, she also needs power points. But, we're going to be teaching it to Ragnarok. Simply because Ragnarok has had his initial attack the longest out of any of our Pokemon. Yeah! Bye-bye, Peck! Now, it actually was relatively useful, uh, grinding in Rock Tunnel, running into all those Parises. Uh, Peck, with, um, uh, with his double, with Paris's double weakness to, um, uh, to flying, they went down quick, and having a, uh, an attack with 35 power points really helped out. And we found a rare candy, la-di-da. And yes, I was that picky. Okay, so now that we got our rare candy, yeah, we still have another one we're going to need to use. Okay, Hatsuna, you do your thing. Okay, Hatsuna, do your thing again. Now that we got that done, let's go ahead and come back to the Safari Zone. There's a ton of items that we missed. Sure. Okay. Okay, so now that we had the ability to use Surf, let's go ahead and use it. Get this Pokeball. 
It is a nugget! Nice! Surf again? I just don't- I just don't want to run into anything. There's nothing here that interests me. Okay, Max Revive uh, revives uh, the target with full health as opposed to a regular revive, which revives them with half health. Max Potion does what you think it does. It heals the target full of hit points. You know what? Let's go ahead and come back here. That was a Paris. Okay. Come up here. I could have swore there was a Pokeball that we missed here. There it be. A Quick Claw. What the hell does that do? I've actually never seen the Quick Claw before. Uh, okay, where's the Quick Claw? Okay. Uh, I think I'll pass on that for now. The only Pokemon of mine that's really lagging in speed is Hatsune. And given where sh uh, where she's going to be useful, the Quick Claw really wouldn't do anything. You know, our, our opponents are still going to be just too quick. Another Max Potion. And I saw another Pokeball. Sure. And a Leaf Stone. Uh, Leaf Stone, um, I think that's used for Eevee, uh, to be honest. I think they did introduce Leafeon in this, uh, in this generation. I'm not entirely sure. Don't quote me on that one. How many steps do I have left? 80? Yeah. Yeah, I think they introduced, uh, Leafeon in... No, no, they didn't. Uh, I know I've gone over it before, but Chansey is the most ass-backwards Pokemon in the Pokemon world! I mean, seriously, ton of health. I'll give her that. A higher health rating than any other Pokemon in the, po uh, in the Pokemon world. But... One attack from a physical attack, a one hit from a physical attack, and she's out like a fucking light! Ugh. Yeah. Ass backwards. Oh, and by the way, her, uh, her stats are very special based, though her moveset is very, uh, is very physical based. I do not like Chansey in case you haven't noticed. Okay. I oh, hear some trainers. You know what? Let's go ahead and show off S Sphere. We haven't done that. No! We don't wanna. And you have a Spiro. Child's play. Now let's go ahead and show off Shockwave. Ow! Yeah, gain a boosted 483 experience. That's the experience bonus. And another Spearow. Again, 1.5 times normal experience. Another Shockwave. Y no, y yeah, you know what? Let next Pokemon, we're gonna go ahead and show off Spark. And a Fero. This am going to be easy. Die. Sweet. Now let's go ahead and show off Rollout. Die, bitch. Is that all you have to say? 
Well, you were dealing with Megadain Luca. <laughs> That's right here. I'm gonna go ahead and call it an episode. Coming up next, we explore more. And start the little quest that makes Hatsune useful. I will see you all on the other side. Hasta lasagna.